Now, Mexico's first woman president has taken oath and assumed office, making this a historic day for the country. Sixty-two-year-old Claudia Schinbaum was sworn in on Tuesday with several leaders, diplomats and more party supporters in attendance. Mexico's first woman president addressed the country after taking oath. Her speech touched upon economy, foreign investments, climate change challenges and a slew of other issues. In materia economica, se mantendrá la autonomía de... In economic matters, the autonomy of the Bank of Mexico, a responsible fiscal policy, and a reasonable debt to GDP ratio will be maintained. We will promote public investment and private investment. I say this very clearly. Rest assured that the investments of domestic and foreign shareholders will be safe in our country. Parts of the oath-taking ceremony were also stepped in tradition reflecting Mexico's indigenous population and their rituals. But in politics and power, there are always multiple sides to a story. As Mexico celebrated a landmark political achievement, the ceremony was also marred by protests and dissent against the controversial judicial reforms. Thousands demonstrated outside Congress. We definitely want a dialogue with Claudia. If she broke the glass ceiling by becoming the first woman president, we don't want her to be a puppet of Lopez Obrador, but to break with the pact of the patriarchy. We also want her to approach the judiciary workers to reach a dialogue so that this reform is amended as this is how dictatorships start. Claudia Schinbaum faces a mountain of issues as she assumes office, many that have been simmering for years, and one in particular that predecessor Andre Lopez Obrador left for her to grapple with. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.